My name is Katie Law Goodwin, and I wrote First Kill All the Lawyers in Pro Per. Divorce is just an ugly, ugly event. It's a grief that doesn't have a place to put itself. There's no dead body to grieve over. It's just an un, it's, it's just a hole in the soul that, that gets t uh, triggered with a resonant sort of tug. Then bring a lawyer into it. These are two people who are miserably unhappy, and then you bring someone who's a combatant by nature into that. Oh my God, it's horrible, it's horrible. So the best thing to do is represent yourself. It can be done, it's not even that hard, it's just very tedious. So that's what I want to tell people, you can do it, you can do it. And at the same time you're doing it, you can use this dark night of the soul for spiritual wellness in ways that you can't imagine. And it becomes this amazing time for spiritual growth, and it did for me. So that's what the book is about too. It wouldn't make any sense for me to have done my divorce and then not do my own book. And oh God, I love Balboa. Oh, I love him. They just, it wasn't even like self-publishing. They did everything. They're the best. It was like being carried and coddled and taken care of the whole way. And they don't let you go and they keep introducing you to the next person who helps you. And you really have been walked through. They helped me perfect it to make it shiny. Honest to God, I've never wanted anything so much in my life. You know, I've had beautiful homes and I've had lots of things, but I swear to you what I've really wanted all my life is an ISBN number. <laughs> and when I opened, when I saw, when I got the galleys, the proofs, when I saw that there was an ISBN number for soft cover and hard cover, I just put my head down and wept for an hour. <laughs> I, I really mean it. I remember in college, Dr. Gossett and Dr. Edward said to me, if you don't write a book, you're missing the most important thing you'll ever do in your life. And then all these years passed and now I have that. <laughs> it always works out. There's this incredible, this sounds so smarmy, but there's a beneficence in life. There's a kindness and it just keeps moving you up. That's my experience. And if you look at, if you read books about it, nobody writes a book about like, oh, it's just awful. They write about the fact that it's always good. And what was the worst thing that could happen to me became the best thing that could happen to me. And has moved me into a place of wonder.